In an interview with NBC News at Otapi, the Zappo called on especially the young people who turned 18 to register on time and not to postpone to the last minute. Other people who are expected to register in the supplementary registration of voters for regional and local authority elections are those who lost their voters' cards and those who changed their addresses and surnames. When we visited the Otapi Multipurpose Youth Center registration point a few minutes to one o'clock yesterday, only two voters registered and three at Otapi Community Hall. The Zappo is hopeful that the turnout might pick up in the coming days, but he is not really worried because many people were registered during the general registration of voters last year. The message to the people of Omsati, particularly the youth, now they, that they, are, they have finished with the exams, so I urge them to go and register, especially those who are not registered, so that they can be able to cast their vote uh, during the upcoming elections in November. Uh, I wish uh, the people of Omsati to really come in uh, big numbers. So they should not wait until the last minute. So this is the, the humble time to, for them to, to come to the registration point. So at any time, so we are working throughout, uh, even uh, except Sunday, that we are doing uploading but we work from Monday to, to Saturday. There are 73 registration points in Omsati region, 17 mobile, 33 semi-fixed, and 23 fixed registration points. We had uh, some challenges when it uh, comes to, to the kits. The kits is the, the, the system that we are using. Mm. Yeah. Uh, so some of the, the challenges that we face is the, is the warming up of the kit, but this is not a, really a big challenge. It is a, uh, happen when it, uh, maybe like the other teams which are working uh, in a remote area. Let's say if the, the kit is in, in, it is in, a, in the tent and it's, it's getting hot, so that system can also be affected by the weather.